that we're working on you'll see uh, that coming soon but we got these parts got them ready and we're gonna go ahead and spray them cuz I'm just feeling a little itchy man I need to see some glass on something so let's go ahead and jump right into it so we're painting the tailgate and a rear bumper and the rear bumper is raw so before we get to painting this bumper we're going to hit it with some bulldog adhesion promoter but before we do that we're going to wipe it down with some rubbing alcohol so instead of greasing wax we're going to hit this raw bumper with some rubbing alcohol wipe it down get it good and clean tack it then we're going to spray it with that adhesion promoter. Then after the adhesion promoter, we are going to seal the bumper. And uh, we should be good to go for some paint. So enough of that talking. Let's jump right into some action. Went through them steps as you saw. We got my starting line, uh, HVLP gun, gravity feed gun. Got it already set up. I got some 1K speed sealer in here. Usually uh, dries up in about 20 minutes. Uh, after that, oh yeah, spraying with a 1.8 tip. All that good stuff. So uh, we're gonna get this bumper sealed. And then uh, we're going to let that dry, and then we're going to jump right into some color, right into some clear, and then we're going to get this thing done and get on up out of here. Bars. <laughs> Let's get it. Spectrum disposable cups with the adapter, the Black Widow adapter, uh, part number 57506. If you're thinking about picking one up over at our Harbor Freight, uh, also use this same adapter uh, when I sprayed the sealer on 
the bumper with my starting line spray gun, which is actually made by the Bilgus. So if you have one of those guns and you're thinking about using the Spectrum uh, disposable cup system, get you the Black Widow adapter and you're good to go. So uh, let's jump into laying down some base. And then we're gonna jump into uh, clear. So let's get into it. So we're looking real good, getting ready to uh, lay down, clear next, and uh, I'm happy with what I'm seeing. Just black, nothing major, but we're gonna make this thing glass out a little bit, and then we're gonna call it a day. So let's jump right into it. All right, before we get started, just show you the gun. And it's looking kind of dark instead of clear. And that's just because I mixed my clear up, uh, got a little base in there. It's not gonna hurt anything, just gonna give it a little darker, a little depth. So it's just like tinted clear. So anybody asks, that's what it is. And I'll answer that still in the comments. But uh, Black Widow, going at 30 PSI and uh, let's jump right into it.
our kings and queens. So we got to paint it. And they looking good. See a couple little pieces of trash, but nothing that you can't dirt me about. So I am satisfied with that. Gonna all look good. Can you see me? It's gonna all look good when it gets back on the vehicle and the vehicle is all back together. It looks even better when the vehicle is pulling off and you done got paid. So, this is definitely gonna do it. All right, kings and queens, so I think I, I, I scratched that itch that I had, man. I really needed to paint some, and uh, the parts helped me out today. So keep on uh, checking out for the new videos that's coming up. Check out the website, www.undergroundpaintking.com. If you want to, follow me over on TikTok. I'm putting up a lot of videos there that you're not going to see over here on YouTube. And uh, a lot of this stuff is gonna be a lot of personal vehicles. But we got the work done. The vehicle that uh, these parts are going on, got a lot more to do to that vehicle. So we'll be showing you that one as well. 094 Flex. It's been here before and it's here again. But we're gonna get that one finished up. But listen, it's your boy, the UP King, the People's Champ. We out.